Western Antarctica is melting, slowly but surely. Right now, the most important thing to note is the slowly part. 97% of the Antarctic Peninsula is still covered by ice, so it's not that it's all melting, it's all going to go away just like that. But little by little, the 30 million cubic kilometers of ice that cover Antarctica is seeping into the ocean. A small amount of that ice melting is enough to make a significant contribution to the water going into the ocean, which makes a significant contribution to sea level rise. NASA estimates that since 2004, Antarctica has been dripping 118 billion metric tons of ice into the ocean every year, much faster than scientists predicted. And one of the biggest challenges globally from all of this warming, this melt, is that a lot of the human population lives near sea level. Um, a lot of big cities, a lot of agricultural land, a lot of vulnerable coastline. Those changes directly tied to human impacted climate change are making the continent greener quicker. As we know, Antarctica has been the place that has registered the biggest increases in temperature. We have had approximately an increase of three degrees in the last 50 years. Researchers say the upshot of all this melting, if we do not change things, is that sea levels could rise over three meters sometime in the next 200 years. Kevin Enix, VOA News.